Hey guys, and welcome back to Fit With Wit for the new year. If you didn't know, I am doing a video series that is gonna help you with your new year's resolutions if you're trying to get fit, live a healthy lifestyle, all of that nonsense. Today we are doing a full upper body, all of this nonsense, all of it, a full upper body workout using only dumbbells. If you're a newbie to the gym or you're just not as confident yet, yet, as you want to be in the gym, this workout would be perfect because you can grab a pair of dumbbells, even a bench, go to the corner and just hang out in the corner by yourself. Nobody will look at you over there. I hope you guys enjoyed this workout. If you do, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And without further ado, let's get into the workout. Starting off with a tri-set. A tri-set is three exercises completed back to back with no rest in between. We are starting off with a single arm shoulder press using the dumbbells of course and we are going to do 10 on each side. Now the reason why I'm doing this seated is because I believe it takes a lot more core work. You're going to use a lot more of your core as you're pressing the dumbbell up and you want to make sure that your, your core and your torso isn't moving side to side. Stay very sturdy throughout this movement. After completing 10 reps on each arm, we are moving into shoulder press. With both of our arms now, we are doing 10. As you come down, bring your elbows in front of you, turn your palms in, and as you press up, turn your palms out. We are doing 10 reps. Finishing off this tricep with 10 seated front raises. Just turn that dumbbell to the side and raise it up to your chin. We are doing 10 reps. After you complete this exercise, take a breather, about one to two minute rest, and we are going to repeat this entire tricep for four complete sets. Now this is all working your shoulders, and I promise you, they're gonna be toasted, toasted. Now we're moving on to our second tricep. So once again, three exercises completed back to back, no rest in between. These are bent over dumbbell rows. We are completing 10 reps on our left arm and then we are going to move into 10 single arm reverse flies on that same arm. On these reverse flies, I really want you to focus on pinching and squeezing that shoulder blade in the back. Try not to move your body too much, just hold stable. That's why I'm holding onto the bench. Not necessary, but it helps you keep your core tight and you won't lose your balance. Now on these rows, I want you to really focus on bringing that dumbbell back towards your hip. I see a lot of people just bringing their arm up as high as they can. Focus more on bringing not only the arm up, but the dumbbell back to your hip, and you're gonna feel a lot more interaction in your lats than you would if you're just whipping the dumbbell around. Complete the dumbbell row and dumbbell reverse fly, 10 of each on each arm, and then we are going to finish off this tricep with 20 bicep curl complexes. Now it's a little bit, a little bit different, a little bit confusing, so pay close attention. One arm is going to curl out while one curls forward. Keep your elbows pinched to your side so that you are solely only targeting your biceps. We are completing this entire tricep for four sets. Now we're moving on to targeting our chest and our triceps. I'm doing 12 reps of a chest press here on the bench. If you're not at a bench, you can also do this on the floor. I like to bring the dumbbells right next to the side of my boobs and then I press right back up. And to finish off this superset, we are doing 12 tricep dips. This is one of my favorite tricep exercises. I feel it the most. Be weary of your shoulders. Do not go too far low, but make sure to allow all pressure to be in your triceps rather than your shoulders. I am doing 12 reps and we are completing four sets of this. And to finish off this workout, I'm just burning out my shoulders and a little bit more of my biceps by doing 30 of this shoulder complex movement. You're going to raise the dumbbells to parallel. Keep your arms in a box, raise them up to lateral, and then press out. I want you to use a light weight, get a lot of reps in, and finish off this workout strong. 
I hope that you guys enjoyed this workout. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave so you never miss a fit tip with wit again. And until next time, I will see you next time. Okay. Love you so much. Love you so much. Goodbye.